Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Uh, sorry for not posting last night. I was super sick last night. Still don't feel that great this morning, but I feel good enough to do this video. So anyway, we're going to do Season 6, Episode 7 called Told ya, and this is Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. So we start off on the planet Kitson, where Fitzsimmons and Enoch are back at that, um, <laughs> uh, casino type place. And, uh, this guy took the vice and left. <laughs> and then we cut to Earth, where, um, Sarge is taken into, um, the command room. And the agents are kind of shocked by him, because he looks just like Coulson. And then, uh, Quink, uh, it's like, I'm out. I cannot deal with this. Then back on the planet of Kitson, Fitzsimmons and Enoch try to leave, but that's not happening because Kitson wants to see them, and it's not going to go, go, go well. Then back at the base, Yo-Yo talks to Jacko, and he's not doing too well, but he doesn't want any mess or anything, and they talk about his world and how he was like the runt of the family, and that they were bakers, which I thought was kind of cool. And, um, but now, you know, Sarge saved him, and like I said, he refuses medication. Then Mac talks to Sarge and says, uh, he'll be in charge soon. And Mac's like, huh, no. <clears throat> and then we cut to where Deke and Quake talk, and he kind of forts hard on her, but they start talking about, like, how they found Fitz, and the whole situation with that, and it just got a little awkward. So... Uh, then we cut to where Mac and May talk, and then Deke storms in, flipping mad at him for not telling him about the other fits and all that stuff. Then he comes down and he agrees to help them with the technology stuff since the Sims are not there to decode anything really. Then we cut to where Coulson and Matt talk and basically shows him the Coulson hologram and you know, try to make him see, like, you know, and, like, feeling them about their Coulson and how he valuable, valued life and stuff like that. Then we cut to where, oh, um, Kitson, where K Kilson talks to um, Fitzsimmons and Enoch, and, uh, <laughs> they play suck up to him, like, we can be so helpful around here, and that was a no-go whatsoever, and they are sent to a guillotine. Wow. <laughs> and basically you have to hold the blade, and basically this woman comes up and says, I want the two Terrans. So make it happen, and so it happens. And then Quake and Matt talk back on Earth, and then Deke got a tracker working and moved and working out and everything. So the, uh, the agents move out, and then we cut to where Jacko, uh, looks like he was unresponsive, and then he woke up breathing fire. <laughs> so Quake had to go in and knock him out. And then we cut to, uh, back on Kitson, and the girl's name is Izell, I want to say. <laughs> and she wants a crew, and they're going to Earth, and so, of course... They will also go. <laughs> but they need a ship. And so um, they try to go find one. And then we cut to our Mac. Um, uh, mocks Sarge. And then Sarge throws it back at him. Over like Jacko and everything. He's like, no, well, it's fine. And so uh, he throws it back and says, I'll, I'll be in charge soon. You, you just watch. And then... Uh, let's see. So the agents get the stripes, strikes. Then they are on the Zephyr and they're heading back. But once the two, um, are in the same room, they go bazonks, like bonkers. I don't know where bazonks came from. <laughs> um, they go crazy. And so they're bringing Colson in. And so they started to crystallize. And so Sarge wants his, um, uh, team is truck back. And he says... And once Max says okay, um, they literally, he literally says just open the door. They don't like the cold. 
And so um, the cold works, and then we have Fitzsimmons is taking the ship back that uh, Fitz originally came on. And then we cut to where Enoch leaves and gives um, Fitz a device to call him. So says, like, don't call too much because I won't miss you as much. And then he goes like, Al's bluffing. <laughs> and that was the end of the episode. So, um, pretty good episode. I really enjoyed it. I gave it a strong A. I feel like there could have been a couple of improvements, but not like a whole lot. But I really enjoyed the episode. And I like how we're finally getting some more information about the strikes and stuff and like um, their weaknesses and just things of that nature. So I really do like that a lot. And um, we get new characters and from Kitson, he's like the grandson of the first Kitson that came there with 20 um, lowerly servants because I don't want to say the other word because <laughs> I don't want to get... <laughs> um, suppressed <laughs> on this video. Uh, so, um, and then we get the meet the red-headed girl, Izzel, so that's gonna be an interesting character. So, um, I have a feeling Izzel is literally, I want to say that's probably Coulson's boss, probably. Or Sarge's boss, or whatever. So I have a feeling that's who that is. Or... She is the creature that's coming to Earth. <laughs> we don't know yet. So, but um, I think she's supposed to be the good guy. So I have a feeling she's probably uh, Sarge's boss and is in charge of that. Anyway, I'm super excited to see what's going to happen next week. And that's going to do it for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below. Tell me what you think of the episode. Do you disagree? What are your thoughts on the redhead and everything? And just let me know down below. And anything else you want me to review or react to, uh, it'll be like a thousand years where I can get to it, but I'm going to try my hardest. <laughs> and um, subscribe because I also like the channel a lot. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.